26 million people have it and millions more are expected to get it. But the truth is most of us could avoid the predominant form of diabetes. There's different classifications of diabetes. Most of the people in the United States that have diabetes have type 2 diabetes. It used to be called adult onset diabetes. The less common form is type 1 diabetes, which is naturally occurring. Type 1 is an autoimmune disorder which used to be called juvenile diabetes, since it's most often diagnosed in children and young adults. The difference between the types of diabetes, uh, type 1 diabetes is a situation where the pancreas no longer is making any insulin at all. Unlike type 1, type 2 develops slowly over time when the body stops managing insulin correctly. Type 2 diabetes is a combination of someone not using their insulin efficiently or not making enough of insulin. A notable difference is that unlike type 1, type 2 diabetes can be averted with some changes in lifestyle. Stan Hillman learned the hard way after he was diagnosed with type 2. And I guess I uh, brought it upon myself by eating the wrong stuff and never thinking that this would catch up with you. But it does, it catches up with anybody. Risk factors include excess body weight, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, low activity, metabolic syndrome, and age. The wake up call made Stan reevaluate his lifestyle. The diet and exercise, those are the things that are going to make it go for the long run. I, I stay away from sweets, totally. Left untreated, either type can lead to serious complications like cardiovascular disease and stroke. Diabetes educators are available through Lee Health Solutions to help you take control of your life. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.